What's up guys, here's Claudio from Visual Model WordPress Teams and in today's video you're gonna learn how to embed or add a mailing subscription or a mailing list creation form by MailChimp system or services for free without using any plugin for it. So you can add a form, a subscription form from MailChimp into your sidebar like this awesome site does at this blog page or the sidebar of your blog and blog posts. But of course, you can add this form in any other section or area of your website, for example, footer or even some page sections. Maybe a pop-up form. First of all, you're gonna need to create an account on MailChimp, it's free. And the process is uh, quite simple. After that, you go to have a look at the left sidebar of buttons and go to audience. Into the audience, you can see the sign up forms, click on it. And you're gonna be loading the sign up forms for the previously made email subscription list. And on this, you can, for example, choose the form builder or embedded forms. I recommend that you explore every single part of this section so you can create more forms and play around the CSS, the extra styles, the options change the language in the form builder and have other options to mark or not. For example, the form widget. When you have done and you have made the form in the way that you want, for example, requesting the telephone, the name, the middle name and the email, that is probably the most important thing you're gonna select all this code that MailChimp gonna generate for you, copy this and go to your WordPress website. In the example case that I previously showed, we did add this as a widget into the sidebar using the HTML, the custom HTML. Find the custom HTML widget drag it and drop into the sidebar and post the code that you got on MailChimp. Save changes and your form gonna be there. Once I'm already have one in this site, I will not apply a second one, but the process it's pretty much like this. And of course you can post this HTML code that you have got onto the MailChimp website into posts or pages from your website making you able to add this form in every single section of your site. If you're using Gutenberg, go to the plus button on the editor, type HTML, add this component on the page and post the code. The process is pretty much the same using any page builder that you like or editor. And it is. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Feel free to use the comment section below in the case that you have any question. And don't forget to check out the visualmoto.com portfolio of amazing WordPress teams. And I see you later. All the best!